<laughs> hey guys, this is a bit of a weird start. <laughs> I hope everybody's doing good. Welcome to the stream. I, I have a story to tell you guys. So, um, I was getting ready, getting ready to, uh, to start streaming and I'm setting everything up. So I click the, uh, the OBS, um, window and then I click my browser window and I accidentally <laughs> hit start stream. So all of a sudden, what, 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 what? We're five minutes early, no! So for those of you already here, you, you got some extra minutes today. You got a little bonus. I, uh, I actually intended to start today's stream on day 4,835, but we're on day 4,830. Why, you guys might wonder. Well, here's the thing. Today, we're going to do something really interesting. And we're going to do something that little uh, less than a year ago when I just started streaming was a very scary thing. It was a thing where I had to uh, I had to prepare a little bit. I had to get ready. And then today, I actually felt the exact opposite. I was about to get started building the framework. And then I thought, you know what? It's way more fun to do that with you guys here. So today... As you may have read in the title, we're building a lava squid. And that there is the foundation. No, Mr. Gast, I'm telling a story. No! Oh, they, they have no, no social awareness whatsoever. That was not the time. <laughs> Let's get rid of this one as well. All right. So we're going to start building here. It's going to be a lava squid. So it's going to be located in this lava lake here. And this here is our uh, reference base from which we're going to build it out. I took a bunch of dirt because we're going to get started with dirt. And then later on, we're uh, going to change it up a little bit. And we're going to work mostly in blackstone. Also, today I have even more diamond armor on. Because now, also with my elytra, I'm going to have full fire resistance while we're in the middle of this uh, this lava lake here. More confusion. Looney, you're on day 4,800. Don't you have any netherite? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, welcome to the stream. I see Kashan is here. Scooter Bailey is here. Clash, Agastya, Kepi, In Sigma, Jaden, Happy, and Person080. Welcome to the stream. Okay, guys, I have a plan here, and the plan is we're gonna build refer reference block for the reference blocks. My my. One two. We're gonna check these. Um, why, why are we in a tree? Let's get out of here. Um, that curve is not, not, um, shallow enough. It's too steep. So we're going to do it again. Other side. This is why we're using dirt. Way easier to replace. I think it goes over here. Endercraft, what are we building today? We're building a foundation. Because we're not going to be able to complete the whole build today. This is going to be a pretty big one. We're building the foundation for a lava squid. And to do that, first order of business is we have to figure out the angle for this thing. I actually realized something. I'm not going to make it lean in that way. I'm going to make it lean there. Makes way more sense.
Uh oh. This is in the wrong place. Of course I did. How accurate is this going to be compared to a normal squid? Not accurate at all. This thing is as big as a castle. Is it lava squid or is it Gerald 2.0? It's completely different. It's a very, very different beast, this one. Which is why we're going to have to design it from scratch. Um, Okay, this works, but we need to tailor it in a little bit. I'm actually not sure about the, uh... I, d I don't feel the, uh, the angle just yet. We're gonna try this one more time. Gil, the Stardust, the Stardust Angel, you're uh, getting flashes of me dying in lava? No, it's not happening. It's only a one block deep here, but don't tell anybody that because it's gonna be completely unbelievable that there's a whole squid in there. Also, I have even more diamond armor on today. <laughs> Which means even more fireproof than fireproof slippers. Is there already a name for the squid? There is, but I'm not yet gonna tell you. <laughs> Some, some people might have heard it, but most of you are going to find out either later today or maybe even next week. I like this curve. I like this curve a lot. Mika, thank you very much for the compliment. I appreciate that. Um, there's something wrong with the audio. Let me see if I get the voice. All right, it works. I could name the, name the squid Strider. Nah, he already has a name. Um, that curve doesn't entirely work. It needs to go out a little bit further to that side. Did you, did you see my little mouse wink there to the right? That, that's the side I meant. It's also probably going to be more diagonal than it is right now. Let's check this out. I think it's too flat on the one side. Dragon, is it going to be made out of lava or magma? Um, for the most part, it's actually going to be blackstone. I'm uh, looking at the lines here. Um, I feel like... Here it's going to need to go up a little bit. Also, we're going to have to be ca careful with the gas as long as we're working with the dirt. There we go. Um, let me check that real quick, guys. I uh, hear that the music is a little loud. I decreased it a little bit. Wait, I think I decreased it too much. Then I increased it to more than it was. Th this is good. This is good. We're getting somewhere. <laughs> I think we're we're about in the right spot now. Oh, uh, I already love this build, guys, and we we've barely done anything.
We need to uh, <laughs> flatten this one off. And actually, this block, that's one. Behind that one, we need to go down. Thank you, Queen. Got it. I said go down. That's not always the easiest thing when you're in the nether. This one. Is the squid gonna protect the nether hub? Maybe, maybe if we ask him nicely. Um, this one block needs to go. And then this section here needs to come down a little bit. That's not where I needed to go, but it is going to help to get there. It's alright, Queen. Alright, these go here. <laughs> Loads of gas. Let's deal with those. <laughs> Look at these guys running. Not quite it yet. I feel like it needs to curve in a little bit more. Uh, so we're gonna go on this side and move it in. This is gonna be the longest part of the process, guys. Getting that first initial line right. But it's super important. Because if you get that line right, then the entire thing is gonna look more like the thing that you want it to be in the end. Um, when we went down here on this side, I think we made it too wide on the bottom. So that one's gonna go out. I'm actually going to place one block out front here because we might need to bring it in a little bit there. Now these three blocks here, they actually looks like the shape we need. Um, we need to be able to connect it up here though. So it looks like this one needs to come one block up again. What about that? No, Mr. Gas, I don't know where you're coming from, but it's not gonna happen. Get going. Letters of my name together make fun stream. <laughs> nice, that's awesome. Okay, almost it. That one bottom block needs to go. That's the one... Uh, change we made earlier and we're just gonna have to roll it back and now we need to uh, give it more of a shape going outwards from here Double miss that. Okay, that's also not it, but that is gonna allow us to place the block we need. And that one needs to go. Uh, something went wrong with my counter. Let's fly away and see what. Um, needs to go out a little wider, and the error is actually. Here. Let's start by addressing that. So now it's the same here. One, two, and three.
Uh, principle is alright. Does this look good? It does, but here we have a block missing. <laughs> this is so tricky to look at when it's diagonal. This goes here. <laughs> You're watching a movie with a dragon, and the moment the dragon attacked, you heard a gas noise from the stream. I bet that had you startled. Uh, it needs to come out a little wider here. And then this on the top is currently uh, excess material, so we're gonna get rid of that first. Why smite over sharpness? Uh, one hit kills on skeletons and zombies make it easy to thin out a whole herd of mobs quicker. Uh, that's my reasoning behind it. Alright, let's start with this one and build three blocks up there. Uh, one, two... No, wait. Not that one. So that one, two, and then this is three. Take a look at that. We're gonna fly quite far with the elytra today. I think this is actually already really close to where we need to be. Um, let's see if we can just place a dirt block here on the side. Perfect. Major Paul for the name. Uh, I already got it figured out. It's not Gerald's cousin. They are not related. And the name is uh, name is secret for a little while longer. This is completely in the wrong place. Wait, let me check that. So up to this point, it's good. Oh, here we're just missing one block. Um, but the question is, do we need to go out that far? Let's get rid of those last layers. See what that does to the picture. It means we put this block here and remove this one completely and then the same goes for this AGM did I finish the end statue? everything except for the uh, interior which we're gonna get back to that a whole lot later on what about we get rid of this one? I feel like it needs a little bit more of a point. But if we make a normal point, it's just gonna look really... Uh, really straight. So, here's an idea. What if... We go out here. The same thing here. <laughs> Bent out, your low battery came up and you thought I died. <laughs> The scare. What about this? Oh, that is that is a whole step in the right direction. Only thing is that it's a little bit big. Um, do we get rid of that? Let me look at my uh, reference picture for one moment. Yeah, it is a little bit big. It's going to need that point for sure, but this section is a little bit big compared to this one. Question is, where do we start removing it? Because it does need to uh, go out a little bit wider to have that feel. What happens if we remove these two blocks?
Now, I need to guess which blocks they were on this side. <laughs> no, I'm not going to guess. I'm, I'm going to take a look. Because otherwise, we're going to make a mess here. This one goes here. I was looking at the right blocks, but it was important to check it here. Should make it have tentacles for sure. Make them go in to the castle. Guys, today is one of those rare days where I'm going to be very stubborn about it. <laughs> because I have, uh, I have a design figured out for this. And there's reasons as to why I've designed it a certain way. Alright, this goes here. I want to just get rid of this for a moment. Oh no, that feels like I got rid of way too much. No, actually didn't. It was fine. It had me scared for a moment. We're gonna lose a lot of dirt here. And then we're gonna rebuild the same section one more time. Um, not a problem. Part of what we're doing. That last line, I'm gonna leave it attached because I'm gonna place it right back otherwise. Um, this one still needs to go. And then this one needs to go. And then from there we build it up like we did before. Means we're gonna land on this platform on the side. Get rid of this, get rid of this. And then that is one, two, and three blocks. Which we're going to place on the top as well. So one, two, three. Can we squeeze under there? We can. I think this might be the final shape. I had to move my reference picture out of the way because it was over my chat partially. Um, now the thing it needs is for this area here to come in a little bit. And I think I'm just going to remove these two blocks and then also these two blocks. Guys, for those of you who, uh, who asked me how I designed my builds, this is probably... The best ever moment to pay attention because in this stream we're gonna go through all these steps and I'm gonna refine a line until finally we get to the point where it works with what I want to build and then we move on from there. Bree, thank you very much for a cup of coffee and another 40 Swedish crown donation. Much appreciated. Now now this connection is a little bit thin, but I feel like um, I feel like that one, we're going to be able to fix it with a stairs on that line. Mr. Chips, welcome back, dude. You're going to have to, you're going to have a really busy sim summer, but you will pop in when you can. Dude, I look forward to uh, seeing you here. When you can make it, but don't feel bad for not being able to uh, to get to every stream. Oh, regardless of it busy, bu being busy, you're going to have an awesome summer. Or despite it being busy, I should say. Um, Let's take that one out. And then that one. We've almost used a stack and a half of firework rockets flying back and forth through this thing right now. And this is all we have to show for it. I love that. Um, I think this looks good. So I have one issue with this design currently. And that is that in the way I built it right now, his eyes would be underwater or under lava. Now that clearly isn't a possibility. That's not an option. So the question is, do we have to change it up a little bit? 
Or do we take some artistic freedom and put the eyes like right here? Champa, welcome to the stream. What are we doing? We're building a uh, giant lava squid. Floating in this lava lake or swimming in this lava lake. And this is the framework for it. The, the shape that we need. I like the shape here, but there is some issue with where the uh, where the eyes go. I feel like in this current shape, I'm not gonna have room for both eyes, and that is problematic. What if we go to this angle? And we put them like here and here. That would be good, but I don't really like the uh, the angle of that. Jay, should, should we just tell everybody the squid name? <laughs> okay, he's gonna be he's gonna be called Brutus. <laughs> I didn't think he did. Um, right now, I'm actually going to move this uh, reference line over a little bit and give it some, uh, give it a little bit more of an angle. So right now, the rotation in the design is, isn't there yet. Um, so what I want to do is take this entire reference line and move it over uh, a little bit to the side as we go towards this direction and that will, will give it some sort of uh, rotational movement which is going to make it more interesting it's also a perfect moment to lose track of what you're doing so we have to be a little bit careful here with the steps Yeah, I think that works. <laughs> Brutus more like brute sus. No. <laughs> Roblox Live, why 30 FPS? Um, it shouldn't be. On my screen, it looks like 60. All right, now we have to move this line over. Jonathan, welcome to the stream. Just your average line, welcome to the stream as well. Jesse is here. Afan, welcome to the stream. Um, this one needs to be a transitional block as well. Uh, I, I killed something that I didn't want to kill. There. Because otherwise it doesn't connect anymore. We might... No, no answers whatsoever. <laughs> um, there's one question about this uh, twisting shape here. Is I'm going out quite far towards there and then I'm coming back here. I feel like a better move might be to keep this entire line that we just had going out backwards to keep it going backwards and that will put some literal rotation in there then the only question is where does it connect up down below but that would put this line that we have here on the other side i'm, I'm just going to try both options and see which one works best
Relax out one big eye. I feel like it's um it's gonna make it hard to make the 3D movement believable if we just give him a uh, single eye. It could work though. We need a beacon here. Could be useful for sure. Jump boost would be really nice during this uh, build. Okay, I'm gonna try to look at it and not see that front line, which is not the easiest thing in the world. Um, yeah, we're gonna be able to work with that. Which means that we're gonna get rid of this pillar over here. Uh, run around to the other side. We're gonna need to keep that and then get rid of all of this. Asha, happy birthday! Um, so now we have this line coming out here to the front. I don't know if we're gonna keep that. Let's take a look at it I feel like that one line that comes out to the side this is dirt, right? Yeah, it is um that messes it up. So we're going to have to uh, bring that over by one block to put it back in line with the rest of it. And we're on fire. But also still flying. And it's this line is the one we're talking about. Um, is it though? It's actually the one that goes up a higher a little bit. Let's tower up and get there. It's uh, this one. Your sheep are yellow, black and white. You only need white wool, but you don't want to kill them. Can't you dye it? Can you use white dye? Which comes from bone meal and it's uh, fairly easy to farm. Alright, this uh, fin shaped thing on the back of his hat needs uh, to have the shape fixed. I think this is what we're going to work with. Oh yeah, this is awesome. This is really cool. This is going to work. Um, it needs a little bit uh, more depth out front here. I feel like that's the last thing we're gonna adapt before we uh, we go into the blackstone. Is that the one line? Infinity Gamer, am I on Switch? Uh, no, I've been streaming on YouTube so far, and it's going great here, so I don't have any reason to uh, switch over, really. Maybe later, but not right now. What if we do this? Okay, all that rotational movement makes it really hard right now, uh, but that's going to work out great in a little bit. So we're just going to go with it. I feel like uh, we're going to make this one line blackstone. And then from there we're going to continue working with dirt around it. Because it's just a lot quicker to work with. And easier to replace. But one blackstone line as a foundation is a bit of a safety measure. Because if we have that one safety measure. 
<laughs> if a gas shoot it, we don't lose all the all the frameworking. Weep with a nine pound donation. Just total it for 69 pounds over two streams. <laughs> Noise. <laughs> Dude, thank you very much. That's insane. And also, you made me choke up in the middle of a sentence. I couldn't even finish it with a straight face. Uh, we're gonna take this one. Blackstone Shulker. And get busy. Quick sip of water while we make our way back to the nether. Peter, what are we gonna build the squid with? Uh, mostly blackstone and then dark grayish blocks. I'm already excited about this build. It's gonna take us a couple streams to get it right, but it's gonna be awesome. Jeremiah, should you go for a full netherite beacon because you almost have a stack of blocks already? If you're gonna enjoy that process, if you have been enjoying it, by all means, go for it. Use redstone blocks for the ice. Um, for the ice, we're actually going to need blocks that emit light. So I'm thinking shroom lights. Nice, Jay. Do I make a plan for the builds before I build them or as I go? Um, I design a concept for a build before I do anything. And then after that point, it's kind of on the flow. All right, we are going to need blackstone blocks for starters. Uh, shovel. And then we're just going to follow this entire line. All the way up. Ismail, did I learn to build somewhere or is it practice? Uh, practice. Help can get you a long way, but if you want to learn anything, the deciding factor is the time you put into it. So after we do this blackstone line, guys, we're going to go back to the uh, to the dirt we have been working with. Uh, because it's easy to replace, so don't mind if it burns up. But it's also a lot faster to remove if we need to get some out of the way again. reason that we do this one blackstone line is a safety measure. Because I don't want to risk losing the shape uh, due to a gas shooting at it. If I lose a little bit of a frame working around, that's fine. But if we lose the basic line, we're going to have to do that same struggling uh, thing that we just did. Uh, all the way again. <laughs> going to be very frustrating to do. Costs us a lot of time that we don't really need to put into it. If we uh, are a little bit smarter about it now. So that is why. This girl, Jay, thinking I was building with obsidian. No, 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 That's a good idea, though. We are going to put obsidian into it later. Looney Lovegood, what a message. Luna Lovegood, that's crazy. Wow. Luna, I'm uh, I'm glad to help a little bit. That, that's a special message. It means a lot. 
Um. Tentacles out of the lava? Of course, guys. Essential. Um, this one, we're gonna take it out. We, we don't need it anymore. The temporary block. It wasn't meant as a temporary block, but I just now realized this, it went out to a white. Liam, how do I keep my motivation throughout these massive projects? Do I just focus on the end goal all the time? Uh, yeah, that's it. That's it. I just keep looking forward to... The thing it's going to be when it's done and remember why I thought that was worth it in the first place. Uh, because that never really goes away. The thing that is true at the very beginning is true at the end. This goes here. Keep flipping, dude. Well said. Well said. We're uh, working on a lava squid today. Uh, this one's called Brutus. And he's going to be coming out of this lava lake. Tentacles all over the place. Very dramatic. Let's actually take a look with the... Um, builder shaders. Just for the feel of the lava lake. And then the contrast. Yeah, that's going to be awesome. Um, now the question is, next step. I feel like the first thing we have to uh, figure out is this sort of fin that he has on the top of his head. And the reason I'm choosing that is it's a very specific shape. And these are, uh, in reality, quite flat. So we have to replicate a way to make that a flat-ish shape. And after we complete any one part of the build, and it usually doesn't matter much which part that is, you have some sort of a reference to go off. And that reference is going to help you a lot in deciding the uh, shape and size for other parts of it. We're also going to have to count. Uh, 4, 5, 6, 8, 10 blocks, 12 blocks, 14 blocks, 16, 20 blocks high. That is just about perfect. Uh, that means the basic tentacles, they get to be at most 50 blocks long. And then a uh, squid opposed to an octopus has two really, really long tentacles, which get to be up to 100. I feel like we might try to do this out of blackstone right away, but it's probably not the smartest thing to do. Reason to do Blackstone right away is that it's a little bit easier to visualize. Reason not to do it in uh, Blackstone is that if we make a mistake, it's going to be harder to adjust. The thing I'm looking at right now is where this uh, thing starts, and it's right here on top of that dirt block. We're gonna get rid of this one. And then fill this one in. Atharva black concrete would look really cool, but we're gonna go with blackstone because it has a little bit more character out of itself. Um, this is almost perfectly right. Galaxy God, how sad would I be if I died? Big sad. Very big sad. Given you just joined for the first time? Welcome! Thank you for doing that. Happy to have you here. Leaderboy coordinates of the Nether Hub? Uh, we're in a... It's built very close to 0, zero actually. We're just going to fill this in, except I do not have any blackstone right now. Mm. 
Mehara with another 19 ru <laughs> 19 rupee donation with a very very expressionless emoji. <laughs> you chose me for I like this one. Dude, thank you for the continued support. I really do appreciate it. Alright, this one goes here. That one is a temporary block. You man, first time here? Welcome! Do we leave that there? I think we do. Make it! Make it! Oh no, we're on fire. That's why I have all the diamond stuff on though. Um, shape is awesome, uh, except that one blackstone block on the top. That one sticks out a little bit weird. Um, I'm talking. Oh, <laughs> missed it. This one? Is it that one? It is. It needs to go here. Andrew, 420 god apples? I don't think it's ever gonna happen. I do not think it's ever gonna happen. It would have a uh, terabyte of storage for my Minecraft world. And from here, we're gonna continue with the dirt, guys. What are we currently doing? Asks, I'm lazy. Lazy you are! It is in the title, my friend. <laughs> I'm, I'm messing with you. But today we are building a uh, lava squid. Which is going to be quite something. Quite the puzzle. His name is Brutus. And he's going to live around his castle here. I did one weird misplace. Oh, it's in the middle. I'm gonna leave it there for now. Um. Red one to t one two three sixty nine gold apples. Yes, sir. It was quite a quest, but it was really, really fun. Uh, misplaced there. Jack, do I have a picture of a squid near me? Uh, I do. There is one on my second monitor. But at this point, I don't really have to look over to it anymore. Uh, that's just for the first little portion where you, we kind of figure out the basic shape. Okay, that looks like it is exactly on the line where it should have been. So these rings, we're just going to fill them up towards the top. And from there, we are going to find the one... Uh, Basically, we're making the sections that we have to make decisions about smaller by going all the way around. We're going to do that a couple times and then we're going to see where the rings fit and where they don't. And from the places where they don't, that's where we kind of start actually designing it. Um, this one is... In the wrong place. Wendy, welcome to the stream. Joined for the first time. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Um, is it worth it to put efficiency 5 on a shovel? I honestly have no idea. If it, I feel like it would be.
I think it is, uh, I think you see a difference between having efficiency 4 and 5. But I'm not entirely sure. Andrew, this song is a jam. I fully agree, I love this one. Laser, dude, welcome to the stream, and thank you very much for kind words, I appreciate it. All right. Fly out a little bit. Uh, this is generally working. We can already see here that this uh, bottom circle is off by one, uh, which is actually to replace it with Blackstone going to be super easy. Which efficiency do I have? Um, I do have efficiency 5 because it's fairly easy to get, but I, I'm not entirely sure whether it, it makes much of a difference. I do use efficiency 4 sometimes when I go out gathering sand and I feel like it's, uh, it's equally fast. I'm not entirely sure. I'm not entirely sure this is the right approach. I'm gonna try something different. We're gonna get rid of these. Do we get rid of them? No, we don't get rid of them just yet. They might still come in quite handy. In which case I'm gonna regret having uh, destroyed them. Uh, what we are gonna do is we're basically gonna take this line and copy that one over to a different location. See how that works for us. This is also going to be such a puzzle. You never refresh your Google pages and you still had a stream open from 69 gold levels? That's a little while ago. Wow. I would uh, I would recommend refreshing them because all of that is in your cache memory. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, I think, I think we won this game of tennis. Andrew, do I think a ocean monument in the end would be a good base? I think that could work awesome. Uh, this goes here. Emil, welcome to the stream. I do stream a lot. Uh, true that. <laughs> true that. It's hard to argue anything on there. Um, okay, we're, we're making a mess right now. This uh, doesn't work at all. I'm trying to replicate a line from one place to another, but that's not what I should be doing. What I should be doing is making sure we don't get shot here. Okay, that's gonna make a mess, but better there than here. Um, what I should be doing is moving the line slowly towards this point, because that's where they all meet up. We're gonna try it one more time. Uh, we're gonna start from this block and just slowly move in the direction of that one. Asha, when will I make a Q&A video? I, I feel like uh, the streams to a large extent are exactly that. So if you have a question, feel free to ask it. This one's gonna have to go, and then this will connect up. I feel like this was a much better, uh, much better approach. Yeah, that line works. Uh, everything else is ridiculous, so now is the moment where we're gonna remove those, uh, those circles. 
Robin, the fire ants isn't in my health bar. Uh, I'm aware. And there's some purpose, because I do currently have my fire resistance maxed out, even though I have my elytra. Because of them fireproof slippers. But thank you for keeping an eye out. Saraf, do I make enough money to live off of my YouTube channel? I do. This is my full-time job. Which is pretty awesome. So I appreciate you guys being here to make that happen for me. Razor challenge complete this in one stream? No, 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 no. Not happening. Never. <laughs> there is no way. We got to take our time and make this look right. Okay, let's get more firework rockets. And then we're going to do another line. Big fat bird, how old am I? I'm 30 years old. I want to have my bow here. <laughs> King is live, present, marked. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Will I reveal where I live currently? If and when I remo uh, move to a different place. Um, that seems fair. I, c I think I can do that. <laughs> fun, fun, ba fun battling. You're not wrong. You are not wrong. I think that is just about it. Uh, Elytra check. Durability is still looking good. These go here. Okay, awesome. That shape is right. Another one here. Mr. Badger, how do I design and plan these builds? Um, mostly uh, happens on the spot and the secret ingredient is taking your time and having a lot of patience with it. Which is why we're flying out so much and going back and forth to uh, find the right shape. Which is also why temporary blocks like dirt are awesome. Do I have a gunpowder farm? Of course, I've had this world for a long time. And gunpowder farms, I would say, are one of the most important ones to get. Because they give you access to plenty of rockets for uh, all your adventures. Glass of water, guys. Biggest project in Minecraft, Asha? Um, probably this uh, this nether base, the biggest one, yeah. Let's take a look at it from this side, because... Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, here it's a little bit thin. We need to go out to the side a little bit more. So this line we just made... Needs to go over here. Before it goes back in there. Get rid of these blocks now. Oh, 
Mine at the two I used as temporary scaffolding. I think that just about did what we needed. Lunius is the world longest hardcore. Um, it's getting up there, but it's definitely not the longest. I feel like that was a very narrow miss. And again, well, he's far away. It doesn't matter. Um, this one goes out a little bit too far now. So we're going to bring it back in a little bit. No, 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 no. Oh, that was the... That was the wrong play altogether, but it worked out. Apparently, it did not break the dirt block. That, that's a surprise. I did expect that to be blown up when I placed it there. The intention was breaking line of sight, but it was actually too late. Um, this one goes a little bit... Goes in a little bit sooner. Real MMR, Gerald, the Nether Edition. Uh, it's something a little bit different. But at the same time... I absolutely see where you're coming from. Brutus, we're gonna call him. But right now, he's just a pile of blocks. Dirt blocks. And we're in a tree again. Not where I want to go. Okay, this works for the most part. Do I go to school? I, I did go to school. I actually uh, completed my university and now, now I don't have to go anymore. Now, now I'm free from school. I get to play Minecraft all day. <laughs> that one block was, I think, an important fix. Yeah, very. Uh, fix that line. All right. Um, next up, we're going to start thinking where the uh, tentacles are going to come out. Uh, which day is it? It is currently day 4,833. I'm thinking one here. We're going to move quite slow here. Because everything we do wrong is going to create a lot of extra work. Well, if you beat me on a duel in high pixel, in a duel on high pixel, can you get the world download? Not a chance, dude. Why would I do that? I'm terrible at PvP. I tell you guys about my excitement level when I didn't need to study anymore. I was pretty happy I graduated. But study, this is true. This girl Jay said studying never stops. That is very true. Just last week, when I had my editing days, I was reading books and watching videos for two and a half days. To figure out what I was going to do next. You never stop learning. Uh, temporary block. And the actual tentacle. That's what the fireproof slippers are for. No stress. So, they have eight tentacles. Uh, not all of which have to be above lava necessarily. And let me check my helmet. Durability looking good. Uh, the golden helmet takes a lot of damage if we uh, go on lava. Um, what is the squid going to be called again? Brutus is his name. Okay, so I want one here. 
And then there's two big ones. One that goes out around here. And one that goes out around there. I'm going to take care of that gas real quick. Uh, tips for covering huge areas with water. Uh, make a diagonal line with water sources and it will fill the entire room. Tails, have I uh, tested this world in creative? I, I have not. We're figuring it out right here. Which is why I'm uh, not talking a lot and flying around a ton today. Let's land here for a moment. Um, this one, this one is too close and that's going to be problematic. We are going to need a bunch of um, lava buckets. To fill in those areas where we're putting dirt blocks now, but we want to remove them after. I think there's a sugar box of lava buckets in the heart of the sea, so let's go and get that real quick. What is my second favorite game? I don't have a consistent second favorite game. It changes all the time. It depends what I like for the week. But Minecraft is, uh, is up there with a huge distance. What I played most over the last year was beside Minecraft was Rocket League. Uh, I didn't play it much at all. I think I played like 30 games over the last year. Guestimate. Casper, dude, that's awesome. I love that. Alright, this one closest to his body, we're gonna get rid of it. Oh, one more like for a thousand. Who's gonna do it? I got out of it. <laughs> we got it, we got it, we got it. Now I'm really curious how, how many more are gonna happen. Because we have a little bit of stream delay, of course. So that happened before you heard me say it. <laughs> and there's a bunch more guys. Thank you very much for all the support. Really appreciate it. Mambo Sam, welcome to the stream. Okay, that's better. <laughs> you guys were all number 1000. Awesome. Um, I'm thinking we need one here about. Is that right? Looks about right. Why don't I make my fire pro armor netherite? Because then I can't see the difference anymore without going to my uh, to my armor slots. Yeah, this this man is about to fight us. I I just missed him by by so much. Now uh, this man's gonna fight us. And there was one more, but I think he's chill. Yeah, he's gonna pretend he didn't see anything. He knows how it's gonna end. Devilish, congrats on hitting day 783. I'm doing good. And it sounds like uh, you're doing quite well yourself. I'm glad to hear that, of course. This is called the Looney Hub. Nice.
Ouais. If I don't fix the lava sources, it can look like it's flowing because his tentacles are there. Uh, could be, but I feel like it's something that we should design later on other than uh, accidentally have it happen. So for now, I'm just going to fix everything and keep it tidy. Moments that tempted me on to cheat on Minecraft. None ever, because it defeats the entire purpose of all the effort you did before that. Okay, one really far out here. Beautiful thing is I don't even think... Oh, we, no, we have to get rid of the dirt because lava is a little bit lay the, uh, lower than that. What is the name of this project? Um, it, currently it's called the Nether Hub. Okay, th this line needs to go a little bit further out. Lakshay, you're about to hit 150 days in Ultra Hardcore. Awesome. 20 minutes left, one day. You got this. This is not where you mess it up. If I mispronounce your name, I, uh, I apologize. I'm quite sure I did. I think that did help. Left click to punch air. No, it, it only comes in bundles of 27. So you see me do it a bunch here. That's 27. But 28, I'm a rebel. Need one more lava bucket there. Yasi, what are we making? Uh, lava squid. Because because it's it's really difficult to design, so I thought it was a great idea. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm joking with you guys. I love doing this. I don't mind taking a lot of time to get something done. Um, I think the lines look good. Now the next thing we really need to do is put an eye in place. And the reason we have to do the eye now is that's one of the features that we're going to design the rest around it. So we need to get that right. Gerald's evil cousin. I, From what I know, they're not related. But what do I know? Lava banana, nice. <laughs> um, shroom lights is what we do. Lava banana, I love that. <laughs> can, can we have a tour? Uh, let me fly around the whole project when we get back there. For now, I need to get some shroom lights. 
Barrage, are we making a dragon? Uh, no, a squid. Um, shroom lights is what I said, but... Oh, here. I think, uh... Let's take two stacks, but I, I think a single stack should do. For the very, very quick tour. Uh, this one here. This project is called the Heart of the Sea. Oh, we got action, guys. We got action. Where are they? I miss all those shots. Not by much. Ow! <laughs> Looney, what would you prefer? Losing this world or eating a rotten apple? Give me give me the apple, I'll take it. <laughs> this here is the uh, I, I would probably be sick for a day or three, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Here we have Looneyville. And from Looneyville we're going back to the Nether Hub and back to uh to the build. With the shroom lights and everything. I should make a stream where I do all the stupid stuff. Where I say I would rather do that than lose the world. Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, a single rotten apple is bad. But if you start piling all these things up. That's, that's gonna be, uh, that's gonna be scary. <laughs> Alright, we need to fly out this way. Would it turn red if we put red glass over the eyes? Uh, not really. Time to change this out for blackstone because lava is a little bit lower than the full blocks. Otherwise we could get away with not doing it. But it doesn't work here. Jeremy, big dragons and the statue will be fighting him. Would look awesome, but it's such a big project to go and do that. We have a lot of stuff to finish up before. Izzy Good with a $5 donation. You must have used thousands of fireworks. Love your stream. Izzy, thank you very much. Let me let me show you in a moment how much fireworks I've crafted because it's it's quite insane. We're we're out of the thousands region um times crafted is the best one where you uh can see it One hundred and twelve thousand fireworks <laughs> it's like top four of items that i made insane mr potato please make some fire rest i actually have it in my inventory but i also have fire rest on my pants and my shoes uh, which means that we're currently maxed out, so we're uh, we're completely safe. Say I kill every Ender Boy in the world in Dutch. I I couldn't do that. I couldn't do that. I would never. Mr. Danaf, welcome to the stream. Ultra Nova, pretty surprised the item I've crafted the, mo the most is bone meal. Where do you think these forests came from? They used to be bones, then bone meal, then bone blocks, and then bone meal again. And then, only then, they became a forest. Also, Queen Kitten thinks I, I wasted a ton of bone meal there, but that's just not true. <laughs> K 
Can I tell you guys one letter in my actual name? There's a uh, there there's a there's an E in there some somewhere. And that's how the investigation started. Good luck, my Sherlock's. <laughs> Go crack the case. <laughs> Is Queen Kitten my girlfriend? No, we have uh, never met. Alright, that goes there. Uh, next one. I think we're uh, we're past the dirt stage, guys. It went went quicker than expected. <laughs> Johan just said, "Mark my words." His name is Tim. So guys, you're, you're aware that my actual name is Lunathorn, right? With a, first an E and then an O. <laughs> That's not true at all. Don't freak out. <laughs> I, I'm just going to let you guys sure look it from here. I'm, I'm off the case. Jessica's my hair pink IRL? It is. It is, and I love it that way. Ever since I uh, got the pink hair, I, I've, like... It was, it was kind of a thing. I, I saw it for the first time, and I was like, yeah, that's me. That's completely me. I think it was a design mistake. There, sh there should have been pink, pink hair there when it was born. It's just a small design flaw. You're new to the stream, where's the lava squid? We're currently inside of the lava squid. It's uh, it's this little framework that we got going on. Before you know it, that's gonna be a lava squid. Also, as welcome to the stream, dude. Jeremy, how old am I? My buildings are so beautiful. Am I architect? Dude, what a compliment. Thank you very much. Um, I'm actually uh, 30 years old. And my job before I made a Minecraft channel was making art installations. I've never made a building though in real life. Or designed it. So I'm not, a, not an architect. <laughs> I know a on the case. Diamond Pants is asking why I'm wearing diamond pants. <laughs> nice, I love this. You took it personally when people said that. So, um, when you got the diamond pants, you don't burn. That, that, that's the whole thing. You, of all people, should know that, right? Rob, what part of the squid are we building? Uh, that's gonna be his head. And then these things around here are his... Uh, the part where his tentacles come out of the lava. Jay, how you like this song? Uh, one more left on this side. Well, I'm gonna make a tombstone for the first horse that died. 
Rip Danny. Um, there's actually a little memorial for him somewhere in the world. Where that is? Still a little bit of secret. <laughs> Cringe play says diamond armor is for peasants. I'm too far into the game, I can't use it. I love it though, I love being able to see the difference. I do have netherite armor, mind you. I just I just like the blue ones. It's a style choice. Not at all true. <laughs> it has fire uh, protection on it. And I want to know if I have the right protection. Um, okay, we're going to go out here. We're going to build a uh, little building platform. That, that's a thing. People do that all the time. MVP, the Elytra is low. I, uh, I noticed. Thank you for keeping an eye out. We're gonna switch it before it becomes a real problem. Alright, now we need to, um, to figure out an eye. And this I'm definitely gonna do with dirt. Because the stream lights are quite valuable to me. I don't want to burn those. It's exactly that, Queen. Oh, that... That works surprisingly well. Uh, but... It makes me wonder about something. Need to... Do we need to make that bigger? Or so the the eye in size is is right relative to the build, but it makes me wonder: Do we need the entire thing to be bigger? I don't think we can get away with making it bigger because uh, it it's gonna it's gonna look like it's filled up the entire. Lava lake there. Daron, welcome to the stream. Um, this one needs to go there. We want that same size. Looney, how many cars do you own? Zero, currently. <laughs> Golden Blade, you saw my comment on that dog video? That video was fantastic, I love that. It was a really, really awesome video. It was about a about a husky who went to meet his uh, his childhood husky friend, and he, he was like this old grumpy dog. Up until he saw the other one, and then there were puppies again. It was fantastic. Um, when did I think about making a channel? Okay, this is gonna sound crazy, but um, it is currently the twenty eighth of May. I registered my channel on May 11, so that's uh, one year and two and a half weeks ago. Uh, that means that the first time I thought about making a YouTube channel ever was about one year and three weeks ago. I did it within two days of thinking about it and uh, I haven't looked back since. It's been quite, quite a crazy adventure. What if we do this? Frozen Beast, that is never the solution, dude. That only makes it worse. You never have to rage.
Do you guys see me just walking around changing the blocks again and again and again? That's how tricky designing on a small scale is. We don't have a lot of room and it's it's diagonal. So the first eye was in a really easy place. The second one makes it really hard. This is actually true. We get made a good point. For an actual squid, the eyes aren't right next to each other. They are quite far removed. So, what if we move this one back to where it was? Because that looked awesome the first try. There. And then we find a second location where we can uh, place a second eye. And everything's going to be better because of it. That, that's the plan. That's the plan. Now, now watch me execute it. <laughs> Mangaroo says, "Marry me, Ludi. I'm a single man. I hope you're uh, you're enjoying the, the the single man life. But I'm I'm gonna have to say uh, a hard pass." What about this? That works. That works. Roasted squid. Th this isn't. This isn't you. Brutus is fireproof. How can he be roasted? Um, I feel like this one, we're going to have to build an eye socket out of it. Kitsuna, my opinions on furries? Uh, no strong opinion. You do you. This goes here. That's a hit. Oh, that is actually a really good look for the eye. Let's just uh, put the shroom lights there. That's already a cool eye. Is Chatterson still alive? Ch Chatterson the third, going strong. That means that the actual question to the answer to the question was uh, uh, no. But let me just quickly, quickly say something to distract you. Many, uh, many Chattersons have. Uh, I, I feel like the uh, multiple Chattersons would would be phrased as chatter say. Many chatters say <laughs> have, have died in the making of that ice castle. When I say many, I, I mean two, exactly two. Aiden, do I have a cat? I don't. Uh, my parents do, though. He's, he's called Spam. He's absolutely adorable. And 
He's my buddy. Let's do this side. This needs to go under there. I absolutely love the sound of shroom lights. They're fantastic. It's live, you gotta leave, it's lagging. Dude, I'm sorry for the inconvenience. See you soon. Have a great rest of your day. All right, I think that's what we uh, are gonna build it around. Aiden, how do I get that many light shot? Uh, and city rating. I actually have over 120 in total. <laughs> I love how Filippos just pulled an exclamation point boots. <laughs> because right now I don't just have nether or uh, diamond pants, I now also have nether and boots. Or a diamond. Envy, good point, dude. Let me all back in the world real quick, guys. Spawn proofing this thing is gonna be quite a challenge. We are gonna have to do it though. But right now, I don't wanna worry about it too much. I just want to build uh, because right now it's it's more about the shape. Are there half half slabs? There are. <laughs> Mouse, welcome to the stream. <laughs> Endercraft, thank you for checking on Mouse. Um, so we have a we have a shape that's a little bit tough over here on this side. We're gonna have to uh, fill that out from the start. Jin thought I could use string. I, I don't know where this myth came from, but string actually does not spawn proof. I know that it's everywhere, but it uh, unfortunately doesn't work. But blackstone slabs will, uh, will work perfect. Blackstone slabs and stairs is how we're gonna do this. Uh, no, that's not a thing, Queen. They uh, don't have their own separate mechanic. Do I really like seafood? I, I, I do. I actually don't have it often at all. But seafood's awesome. Uh, very unrelated to how my world was taking shape, though. But these things tend to happen when you start at a base that is called the heart of the sea. Would carpet work? Uh, would work. Would, would stand out though. You would definitely see that. Um, how, how is it spelled? The chat will kill me. Pedo, what for? Uh, that, that's not the part I meant. <laughs> I was curious if it was chat with C-H-A-D. Because in that case, it would make a lot of sense, considering what happened with all the Chattersons. Yeah, Chatters say, I'm sorry. The 
<laughs> Fun battling moved on to a roasted banana squid. Nice. Um, these don't work. Um, no, queen. Strategy Gamer, do I have all of the advancements? All but one. Uh, how did we get here? Having all the status effects applied at the same time? We're gonna get that on the stream where I also go to 5,000 days. Is that one still open? And then I heard that I'm not gonna be able to have all the achievement, or all, all the advancements once the game goes to 1.17.1. Reason being, there is one new advancement where you need to look at the Ender Dragon through a spyglass. But you guys know what happens if I spawn the Ender Dragon, right? That's gonna be hot mess. So uh, at that point, we're just gonna have to settle for having all but one. <laughs> Yash, you got it. You got it. Yash, that was epic, dude. That was that was absolutely epic. Red Dream? You're a muffin, dude. This one is gonna get what is this black thing we are currently building a lava squid which is gonna be awesome but it's it's tricky to build I'm not gonna lie I'm not gonna pretend this one is easy this one is a this one is a puzzle it's very f much one of those freeform builds where we just go for it how much obsidian do I have after mining the end? Uh, I think we mined about 30... Oh, love that shape. I feel like the eye is going to have to extend backwards a little bit. We're going to check that at the end. Um, 36,000 obsidian from mining the pillars. But it might not be the pillars only because I also got a little bit of obsidian from um, clearing... What used to be lava under the heart of the sea. <laughs> William, I'm not gonna die easy because of the fire resistance, fire protection, gapples, and armor. You, you are not wrong. I uh, I came prepared. This is not the day. Although, much likely, the day where I do actually lose the world is going to be a day where I say this is not the day. Casper, is this like the Nether Gerald? There is no such thing as a Nether Gerald, but yes. <laughs> They're completely different. But you're right. <laughs> Netherite pants. Have I seen your rival diamond pants? Um, yeah, but he actually uh, he, he just had it out. I uh, I heard that a ton of people were asking for his autograph, and he had to do a photo show because diamond pants they're, they're in high demand nowadays. They're, they're the new thing. Everybody loves diamond pants. 
Maybe you should uh, you should consult them for style advice. Just uh, I'm not saying you you look bad or anything. Just they look fresh, dude. Neo Human Calculator, welcome back, dude. How've you been? Am I not scared to lose everything? Um, no, I'm. I I still uh, think it's absolutely worth it. Losing it is part of the journey, right? <laughs> Seth Diamond Pants are snazzy. That's exactly what I heard. Sketchy, dude. Thank you very much for a 20 Swedish crown donation. Can I make a really strong long stream today? Oh, dude, I, I wish I could. But no. Because uh, I actually, uh, I'm out of town tomorrow. And I have to finish up a lot of stuff before I'm ready to go. So today is uh, one of those days where I uh, tie off loose ends. I feel like this eye, this socket, has a bit of a weird shape. Uh, this one goes out too far. This one might need to open up. Fun Battling says, hey Looney, try the tongue twister today. How can a clam cram in a clean cram kang twister today? What is a kang? I don't know that word. I feel like um, the shape is actually quite right. Unless we go up too close. Uh, there's somewhat of a... No, th this eye... This one needs to come forward a little bit. See you around, Queen. Thank you very much. See you on the other side. If I if you donate five hundred dollars, will I do a face reveal right now? Not a chance. Uh oh, misplaced one. Um. Does a squid have a head? No. Hats. No. No. He's just steezy like this. Whoa! Ghast looking around the corner. Dodged it. Uh, I think that will probably solve our issue. <laughs> Jake, diamond boots? Yeah, I'm slowly turning into a diamond boy. It's happening. Next stream, I'm gonna be running around with a diamond sword all of a sudden. Wait till I whip out the diamond hoe, though. That's when things get really wild. I feel like this block can help us a lot. Diamond Ludi. Full Diamond Ludi. Fuse, will I try to collect every block in Minecraft? Um, not necessarily, but I feel like it might accidentally happen. Until we get to the really crazy ones like Bedrock, which I won't even try. There's no need for it. I should decorate the castle walls? Absolutely. Just haven't gotten around to it. It's been a, been a big build. Uh, th things take time. 
I actually think, guys, this has is mostly covered for the head. Um, what we're going to do next is we're going to build the tentacles. And then later we get back to uh, detailing and shaping some more. Uh, based off of what the entire build will need. That went faster than I expected. Do I have lava buckets? I do not. Let me grab a couple. Because I placed some accidental blocks under the... Uh, Dirt platform that I built. No, 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 no. Is that a hit? That's a hit. That was a proper sniper. Liam, dude, thank you very much. I appreciate it. We're getting there. Top of the castle looks like a turtle shell. <laughs> Kinda. I get that. We got a little little thingy going on down there. Uh, but for now, I'm going to leave it. Place looks like Bowser Castle. I I've also heard that a couple times. <clears throat> Do I have a pet in Minecraft? A bunch. The heart of the sea is quite a homey place. Okay, guys, we actually did a ton, but we've also been streaming for almost two hours. So first start to uh, Project Lava Squid is a go. We have Brutus chilling in the background. And he's gonna need some, uh, some tentacle action soon. But before we get around to that, it's time for a little 10 minute break. After that break, we're gonna pick it right up. And we're uh, gonna focus on these tentacles, which will bring the build alive really quickly. I bet. Guys, 10 minutes from now, we're gonna continue. Until then, I'm gonna pull up this break screen. And this countdown timer, when those 10 minutes run out, I'll be back. I hope to see you after. Otherwise, thank you for your time today. Thank you for hanging out. I hope you enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you real soon. For now, I'll be back in 10 minutes.
Hey guys, welcome back. Woo! That was a margin of seconds. I just got back into the room. That never happens. The thing that was uh, the cause of all this. Y you guys want to guess? Meanwhile, I'm gonna get to work. I'm gonna let it let it sit there for a moment. Envy's guess uh, is related to washing my hands, of course, which it always is. This is his answer to life, life uh, problems in life. Washing hands. Or not. No, it didn't have anything to do with washing hands. I... I scared power potion. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Lightning, what is Squid's name? He's called Brutus. I um, uh, I'm still letting it sit. I'm still letting it sit. I did a really good song on my headphones. <laughs> I was uh, I was dancing around the room, and I was like, "Yeah, I have time to finish this song." And then I I looked over into my uh, like office where I stream, and I I see 20 seconds on the timer. Like, no, I start running. Slow motion started. I I, I threw my shirt for. For a second, I thought I was in Baywatch. I, I wasn't. <laughs> they made a remake, Jay. Fair, fair enough, fair enough. Of course, that, that shot is the whole thing. <laughs> um... So, anatomy lesson, guys. Squid, they have eight tentacles, and then they have two extra ones, which are like big, grabby arms. One of them is gonna come out here. But where's the other one gonna go? I feel around here. And then... I think... Here? I've already figured out where everything needs to go. Like their final place. But where they start is uh, still a question. Um, then we need a lava bucket. At least one. I'll grab a couple because we're gonna need them eventually. Also, hey, Envy, I, I didn't say I did, hope you're doing well. <laughs> Part of bag, what are we making? We are making a, a giant lava squid by the name of Brutus. Maybe we should start with these tentacles here. Hey, dude. What are the plus signs behind the squid? We're gonna we're gonna start with those right now. They are gonna be the uh, the the main tentacles, which actually aren't gonna be above the lava all that much. You're gonna see what we're doing with them. Uh, first I need to organize this stuff. Oh no, we're definitely gonna need stairs here. So, less lava buckets. Less lanterns, because I clearly don't need those. And less dirt. Less stringer to spider slayer. Guys, I should really... Jay, can you put a message on Looney Board that I need to recover stuff from the dirt choker? Because I'm gonna forget this. Whoa, 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 you mad? No, he's not mad. Oh, he's gonna be mad, though. Let's be mad first. 
Okay, now more Blackstone stuff. We might use a ton of stairs here, so I'm just gonna convert a bunch. Alex, an end ship, make the squid have one of its arms, grab one, make a portal that the ship came out of. Whoa, dude, what an idea. It's quite developed, too. Um, unfortunately, uh, today I'm uh, I'm super stubborn. I'm not going to take any suggestions because I've got this all figured out. Reason behind it, it ties into the story underneath the world. Transom, dude, thank you very much for another $5 donation. Hey, Looney, everything looks amazing as always. Missed a few streams due to work, but I'm back for today. How is it going? It's going excellent. Thanks for asking. Happy to see you back. I hope uh, even though things have been busy, it's also been a good time for you. And I'm glad to see you today. This one is going to go right over here. Nether hub is maxed out, <laughs> says Bimbo. Nice. <laughs> I like that. We're definitely getting to that maxed out stage, which is good. Um, I feel like this one probably gonna go down here. Long is there gonna be a 5,000 days compilation? Absolutely. Really looking forward to editing that too. Bimbo, dude, I'm glad to hear that. I feel like this first one, uh, we're probably going to make a couple mistakes. It's going to be a little bit messy, but after that, we'll figure it out. Lord Puppy, welcome to the stream, dude. For how long have I been playing Minecraft? Um, about a year and three months. What is this one? Why is it here? We're doing the same thing twice, and it's not working. So this one needs to go up there. This thing I just did is really going to help. Um, that denotes what the top is. And then this one needs to be a full block. This one needs to be a full block, and this one... Yeah, now we're getting it. What are we currently making, guys? If you just got here, welcome to the stream. We are, uh, we're making a giant lava squid. Who's uh, sitting in the lava right over there. And this is tentacle one. Um, that works. The movement is right. It's still a little bit, uh, a little bit rough. That's gonna start getting better here.
Christopher, you had your birthday yesterday. You got a pug? <laughs> That's awesome. Late happy birthday. Be, be nice to your puggy friend. Okay, that works. I'm quickly maneuvering my coffee within reach. This is important, guys. Priority. Quick, quick sip. <laughs> Nightfall Gaming says, I know your name is Lunathon. You revealed it on a stream a long time ago. It's a joke, though. I don't think that's a real name. Are his tentacles gonna wrap around a tower next to him? They are not, but they're gonna get close to it. Um, we need walls. I didn't know that was a thing yet, but we definitely need walls. How does that work? Vendor, you wanna want me to play with open to land so you can play too? No can do. Open to land is also how you turn your world from uh, hardcore survival into either normal survival or creative. So I can't mess around with that. Seth, you're getting close to finishing your first base. That's a good feeling, right? Um, I think this one... This one is gonna be complicated. It's only the second one. I'm already going for complicated. This is good. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> well, that for one. The timing on that was impeccable. Arno suggesting to get face cam still. I I just might one day, but for the time being, I haven't done a face reel yet, and I'll only do that when I'm completely ready for it, which uh, it's gonna be f before the end of the year, but not today, and not very very soon. So I think to make this squid the most interesting it can be, we should have these arms or tentacles crossing over each other, which makes it way more complicated. When has that ever stopped me? <laughs> We're just going to do it. Jacob, welcome to the stream, dude. I hope you're doing well today. Um... This is where we're going to have to start moving off to the side, though. Power Potion, tomorrow's your birthday? Exciting times. Looking forward to it, I imagine. I'm, uh, I'm not going to be streaming tomorrow. Uh, because I'm gonna visit one of my best friends for his birthday too. His birthday is actually today, but he's celebrating tomorrow. So I'm uh, already gonna wish you a happy birthday today. Eric, can I complete the Elytra map that I started yesterday? I actually uh, completed it this morning. I needed like two more tries, which is just crazy considering how, how much of a struggle it was yesterday. 
And now it's in uh, in speedrun mode. I don't think I'm going to practice it a lot. I'm not going to try to get better at it. But it's a super cool map. Yos, you haven't been here for the last five days. Can I show you around? Sure, and let's uh, use that moment to see how this uh, squid that we're building is looking. I find you want to shoot without shaders. Uh, we were in normal shaders a moment ago, but I actually go back after we fly around. Matt, how do I stay motivated to play Minecraft? So, I'm in a situation where this is my full-time job, and it's just about the coolest job I can imagine. So, the uh, motivation for me comes with the territory. I'm doing exactly what I want to do, and that is a great feeling. Full hub without shaders is this currently. Without the shaders, it's more apparent that uh, the fortress in the middle is still really, really gray. Which is something that we're gonna have to address later on. The walls need detailing. That's the main thing. We did do these parts on the side. But even there. It really needs some uh, contrasting colors. <laughs> Will the octopus and the squid ever go on a date? They live in uh, in completely different worlds. It's hard. <laughs> Noah, welcome back. Cruising to progress. Small Tough, welcome back as well. I uh, just missed you before the break. I dropped a high before I ran out of the room. I, I didn't really run out, but you, you get the idea. Glad you could make it, and I'm glad you like the hub. It is really coming along. I'm in. Uh, I'm enjoying seeing it grow. What time is it in the Netherlands currently? Um, it's a quarter past four in the afternoon. I'm thinking... This next one might have to go quite long and flat. Okay, we're gonna have to work with shaders here because the thing that the shaders do is they give a much clearer sense of sh light and shadow, which makes it uh, easier to keep track of the design and the points where it's gonna go into or get into trouble because this is naturally gonna look quite tangled, which can both be the best aspect of the design and the most troublesome. This one is next. But I feel like we're going to start with this one and then use that one to go into the remaining space. Ivan is in the nether roof. Yeah, it is. We've built a ton out here to... Uh... Oh, 
we're actually gonna have to take off because otherwise that gas was gonna wreck what we were doing. No, I shot it into my own build. Uh, yeah, this is on the nether roof. So everything around this place. Oh, that squid is gonna look so good in that lake. I love the size of it. It's perfect. Not too big, not too small. The purpose of this entire build is uh, to travel around using nether portals to different overworld projects. Yeah, this is gonna look cool. But because it's on the roof, we've had to build everything. Which uh, has, right about now, almost taken a thousand game days. How did I design the castle in the middle? Did I plan it beforehand? Um, I started out with a uh, big glass circle on the ground and kind of went from there. That was a uh, subpar landing is the word I'm going for this time. Subpar. <laughs> Could have been better. There was, there was a little bit of uh, room for improvement there. Pancake Rabbit, do I drink G Fuel? I never have. Where does this one go? Lava's weird. Thought it was a mixture of saying glass. It's a. Uh, it's in the shaders. These light and dark spots, and I honestly love it. I think it's a really good feature. Other than that, these are not my favorite shaders. They uh, don't work in every location. And in the overworld, the colors are just a little bit weird. Where does this one tentacle go? I feel like maybe this is the one that doesn't go all the way back down into the lava. Gotta love building in survival and just jumping around the entire place to get where you need to be. I honestly enjoy that. Who chose the name Brutus? Um, I did a little while ago. I feel like it's uh, it's a perfect name for this one. I wrote it when I was sitting in a train. I was thinking about it. I was like, yes. That's the direction we have to go. Um, about this one tentacle. Does it go out too far or is it perfect? I think it's a tiny bit too far. Abraham, welcome to the stream, dude. How did I get my XP when I started the world? Um, for the first enchantments, I took a really weird strategy. I actually got my first XP from mining quartz in the nether. I uh, thought that was the safest way to get it. And it worked pretty well, but it's, it's a bit of a weird choice. Got to level 35. And that's uh, all, the, uh, all the levels I needed. Little too far? I, I agree, it, it needed a couple blocks removed. 
And it still needs a couple blocks removed. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's not a lava banana. I told you! <laughs> it definitely used to be, though. I should have my fire residence out in case, just in case. It's right here. This is my fire residence. Look at it. Flames on the wall and everything. I'm messing with you. I have the fire res here, but I actually have fire protection on my leggings and my shoes right now. And that's going to be enough. We don't need more than that. Um, now, because that means I have maxed out fire resistance. Uh, now we're going to have to build up all these tentacles individually, which means we're going to go and use a lot of stairs. Uh, this man's got big plans. I hate magma cubes when they're on magma. They, they move so fast and they're so scary. Or when they're on the lava. It's not good. They don't joke around. Connor, where's the music? Uh, we, we had a bit of a slow starter. It's going to be back in a moment. Sam, welcome to the stream, dude. And thank you very much. Nice entrance. I love that. Wait, what is that? Oh, that, that's already a stair. But then this one isn't necessary. Now I'm confused. This is a full block. Prince Gerald's evil brother. I, I have heard that they're not related. Sam reacted with, what can I say, I'm a bit of a gamer. That's perfect. Exam coming up tomorrow? Best of luck. You, you got this, I believe in you. That's for almost 250k subscribers. Congratulations, dude. Thank you very much. I, I saw in the break. We're on 248. It's a crazy number. Guys, that means we're a couple days off from the first time. I get to use the word million and subscribers in the same sentence. Because we're a quarter of the way there. That's insane. Okay, we can't fit in there. Uh, which means it doesn't have to be a stair necessarily because it is spawn proof already. <laughs> the two squids. Well, they're a squid and an octopus. They live in different dimensions, true. And you're pretty sure that none of them can fit in a portal. You're, you're quite right on that account as well. <laughs> First MCC of season two is tomorrow. True that. I'm gonna enjoy watching that. I, I'm not gonna check it out tomorrow, but I'll uh, check it out after. Jonas, dude, thank you very much. Oh, we're, oh, we're in lap. How did I get out of that? Was that so hot that I jumped two blocks up? <laughs> hot, 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 hot. Boom, two blocks up. 
Juan Perez, dude, thank you very much for a 19 Mexican peso donation. Much appreciated. As a thank you, I'm gonna take your name and put it in this book. And I'm, I'm gonna copy that. So I don't make any typos. <laughs> so I don't make any typos, he says. Straight up, misses the first letter. <laughs> there you go. Dude, thank you very much. I'll copy it over to the wall in the museum a little bit later on. Your support means a lot. Alright, let's uh, continue with this one. Olivia, welcome to the stream. You too, nice entrance. I like that. Uh, out of stairs right here. I'm gonna do this one and then we're gonna take a moment and recalibrate, see if everything looks good. See if this approach is working. Uh, if there's any spots where it somehow looks weird. But I think we're on the right track. Wandering Trader with another 50 peso donation. Here's a mending book. That's a much better, better trade than we made yesterday. Um, Speaking of yesterday and, and our uh, our earlier trade, I'm, I'm not going to stick around for this, wait. Um, there have been rumors going around that by the end of the stream, I actually picked up the three emeralds I left for you on the floor. Uh, uh, I deny all charges. It wasn't me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I'll be honest with you. I picked them up. I, I did it. It was me. I, uh, I was just surprised that you, you didn't come to collect them, so I had to do something with it. As for this mending book, thank you very much. It is greatly appreciated. Blackstone is such a cool block. I love this texture. Ivan, see you around, dude. Have a great rest of your day. And thank you for hanging out. Lair for the dramatic. Peter, if you, if you gotta go, you gotta go, man. Also, welcome back. Um, this right here needs a transition. Did I know Netherrack was called Bloodstone? I did not. That's that's actually a pretty good name. Live with the Minecraft history lessons. I love that. There's so much I don't know about old day Minecraft. Mess it up again. <laughs> Placed it completely wrong block there. We're gonna get it, I believe. <laughs> nope. Nope. Did it. Did it. How's the squid looking so far? Uh, we're gonna finish this one tentacle and then we're gonna find out because I'm actually really curious myself. It's uh, time for a little peek. But I have a feeling that we're getting there. Currently in them boss shopping with your sister. Does she approve of you being in a Minecraft chat right now during shopping? <laughs> I, I'm curious.
Sam, asking if the lava squid can have red eyes. Um, he actually has shroom... <laughs> he also has a pickling on his face. He has shroom light eyes. And his name is Brutus. We almost used a shulker of blackstone on this guy. Guys, I love this so much about Minecraft. Before I did Minecraft, I made art installations and I would have to spend so much time making sure I didn't use more materials than needed because materials in the real world are expensive. And here in Minecraft, if I need more of something, I just go out and get it. And I don't have to worry about it ever. And it is such a liberating way to design. That moment just now where I went like, we've almost used a Shulker of Blackstone. During a real world project, that could be the moment where a slight panic starts creeping in. People go like, are we gonna have enough to, to, to finish the project? Doesn't matter, we're in Minecraft, we can do whatever we want. Just get more Blackstone later. <laughs> uh, this is what the Lava Squid is looking like right now. So you see those small circles, this one and this one, around the side, that's where his biggest tentacles are going to come in. Ooh. Wither skeleton skulls as the suckers on Brutus on the bottom of his tentacles. I hadn't even thought about doing that. About putting anything at all there. I'm curious if they're not going to float when you put them on the bottom. But that would be a super cool design. We, we have enough wither skeleton skulls to do that. Becky, what I love about Looney is he does everything he builds on stream, so we can't accuse him of cheating. It's I'm looking for a balance, so there is actually a lot of off-stream work that goes into the world. But I try to do the, the interesting and the hardest bits, at least on stream. Because if you guys can trust me on this, where we have to go through the struggle of designing something that's actually complicated, then you can also trust me on cutting down a forest when I need wood. And then the off-stream stuff, I try to get the uh, the boring bits out of the way. So that when I am streaming, I get to share the most interesting part of the process with you guys. But I'm glad you appreciate that, Becky. Thank you very much for the compliment. That's cool. AZ, you like the build? Awesome, I'm happy to hear that. Oh, made a misclick there. That one needed to be upside down. There we go. And then here we go all the way back. Much more effective way of doing what we just did. Brenda should, or British should have a wife called Brenda. I, so I agree, but no can do. I look, I look forward to the day so much when you guys are going to find out what the story is behind this world. It's going to, it's going to be a long time before we get there. Word of warning that that's not going to happen next week. Well, at least not unless I die. But today with the construction of Brutus, we get a step closer to a conclusion.
PowerPoint Pro just defeated the Ender Dragon. First off, congrats, dude. That's a good job. That is a major step forward. Uh, but now you don't know what to do. All right. Here's the thing. For me, your world has almost started. You're almost at the point where your uh, your story begins. And before you get there, you need to get your Elytra. If you don't have that yet, it's time to go out into the outer regions of the end. Go through that portal that opened up when you uh, defeated the dragon. And find one of those. Because after you find your Elytra, you can move around your world much, much quicker. Get more resources faster. And generally get more done in less time. After you do that, then it's time to start looking for the mega build and or the, the mega base location. The beautiful thing you can do once you have that Elytra... Is actually fly around and see much more of the world much quicker. So go looking for a awesome place, a place that looks cool that you really really like, and from there start building your base. Before you know it, you're gonna have something really really cool going on. Have I ever played Spelunky? Uh, no, I I have not. Lil Slushy, welcome to the stream. Uh, this one is a misplace. There we go. Ooh, this is a great line. Completely flat, so we don't have to think about it much. It means quick progress. Um, this one doesn't quite work. Evil Gerald? Why, why do you think he's evil? He lives in a lava lake. What if I die in my own lava lake? I actually had a dream about that. So, because of that dream, I don't think it's gonna happen. I think I'm, I'm prepared now. But, it would be pretty dumb. Um, we're missing a whole row here, which is why, uh... Why I was having a hard time figuring that next part out. Cindy, you found three gold apples on your first day in hardcore. That is insane. What a start. Now don't die. Gerald, keeper of the conduits. Brutus, keeper of the volcano. He's, he's going to need a whole title and, uh, and stuff, right? I mean, Gerald has one. How big should a uh, starter mega base be? There is no set size for it. I I said this in a in a different stream, but. Uh, there's this one build Mumbo did where he made a full base that had everything, but it was in one chunk. Now, that wouldn't qualify as a mega base because it's a small structure, but in my mind, that's a mega base. Because it was so intricate and well designed and, and like insane. When, when you have that set up, you have your world set up. And I feel like that's the, uh, that's what you need out of your first base. Nobody gets to tell you, no, that's not big enough your base you make the rules beautiful shot I feel we have uh, like two tentacles left here Brutus keeper of the castle has a nice ring to it
Ryan Manley, dude, thank you very much for the compliment and welcome to the stream today. Hope you're doing well. Um, this is already a full block, so we need a slap on top of this. What's this corner? I'm gonna go with a full block and then a slap there. Uh, makes more sense. Almost done with this one. <laughs> Jochen, that that is a that, that is a great description there. I like that. <laughs> These go here. Funky Maker, welcome to the stream, and thank you very much. I appreciate that. I hope you're having a good day so far. Okay, we got this one done. I want to look at it from the side, a little bit closer up. Oh, that is going to work great. Now I'm not sure about this um, tentacle here, the big one that we still need to make. And there's one small one there in the middle that still needs to be flashed out. Benjamin, welcome to the stream. Move over to the side here. Grab these. B, welcome to the stream as well. Vic, welcome back to the stream. You guys want to have a quick tour? Um, let me finish this one tentacle. Because then we got all of them done. And we can uh, continue planning for the next part. Uh oh, we got one miss. There. Soggy Nuggets, welcome to the stream. Thank you, dude. Appreciate it. That one glitched out. Almost there, guys. I wasn't sure we're, we're going to be able to get under there, but it worked. Manu, do I have a Wither Rose farm? I don't. I do have a uh, Wither Skeleton farm, uh, but not the Wither Rose farm. I haven't really needed it. I've uh, When I needed Wither Roses, I've used... What do you call that? Um, insects instead. All right, small turret built. We got Brutus the Lava Squid. Slowly developing in that lake over there. And it, it was actually pretty fast. Um, he still needs uh, his one big reaching arm over on this side. And that one's going to go up quite tall. 
Um, and then we have room for another one here, but I don't know where it goes yet. Let's, uh, you know what? Electro check, looking good. We're gonna fly around the hub while I think about it. We've been building this thing over the last couple weeks, and it's, uh, it's been coming together really well. We have the Soul Sand Valley right underneath us. We have the Basilisk Fossil, and then here ahead of us is a forest. Then we have the entrance to the, uh, to the castle itself, which has this bridge, which we're gonna try to fly under. Kinda worked. I uh, don't, didn't take a whole lot of damage, that's fine. Then here we have the Magma Biome. We still have uh, two biomes to build out front here. Um, bit of the magma biome, another forest, and that goes into the wasteland. So, two and a half uh, biomes. And then over this side, if we fly over the magma biome, we get to another forest, another crystal biome, which we still have to finish. And then we get to the meteor, the mushroom biome, the volcano, and now Brutus, the lava squid, in the lake there. <laughs> sure, that yes, says Brute is looking hot. <laughs> Brute is keeper of the portals, protector of the castle. That's uh, that's pretty good. Alexander suggested that. That's nice. All right, next up, we're gonna figure out the line for that one tentacle, the big one. Chunky one coming out from here. Why Brutus? You'll, you'll find out when you get a world download. Brutus the Brave Bandit. That has a pretty good uh, alliteration going on. I like that. Not going to be his name, but awesome ring to it. We have two rockets left. That's not a whole lot. Uh, this corner needs to go out a little bit wider. I'm not entirely sold on this shape yet, but I'm just going to try something. Because here, on this one, we have a lot of length to work with. Just based off the uh, anatomy of a squid. Um, we need more dirt. And we need rockets. <laughs> Logan, Looney now has two tentacle friends, so a group of three with 18 hands. Uh, th this dude actually has 10. Eight normal tentacles and then two grabbing arms. Okay, if this works, it has such a nice move movement in it. Whoa, guys, look at that. That needs to come back down towards the tower here, but the shape of that is awesome. This is um, just scaffolding because we need to get there. We knew you just finished school and you got a summer break now. Dude, awesome. Nice. That is... That is really cool. That also made me decide that we definitely need the other one. Question is, where does it go though?
I, I do understand what you mean, though, uh, Jay. Mm. Um, all right, second tentacle. Lots of people suggesting that Brutus grabs the castle. He, he's nice. He's not going to grab anything. He's just chilling there. Just waving around a little bit. I'm still trying to figure out where the second uh, second arm goes. The reason that is a tough decision to make has to do with the concept of visual lines. Um, almost anywhere I put that arm is going to be in our visual of the rest of the build, which isn't necessarily where we want it. I would like it to open up, uh, but it, I would also like it to have a natural shape that makes sense. What if it comes from here? Does that make sense? Maybe he holds a snack with a tentacle. I like where your head's at. For a guy that has a name which says Honey Bear, that is quite, quite applicable. I love that. I think we're going to have to reposition this. That's going to be the start of our uh, solution. The build is only in one direction. Uh, true that. That has to do with exactly what I mentioned a minute ago. Uh, concept of visual lines. If we move it in every direction, it's going to be very hard to find a place where you can properly see it. And by making that harder, you're basically going to kill the effect it could have had. Oh, that worked so well. I never thought that was actually going to work. I just hoped it would. I'm going to let the lava flow for a minute. I was going to fix it, and then I realized that I kind of like it around this build. So this could be the first patch because the location makes sense. Um, Now this leg or arm needs to go. I still haven't figured it out. This one is a hard one. Different perspective. Skills Viper, two enchanted golden apples and four temples. <laughs> that is a really good score too. Oh, so close. We're, st we're stuck in a sniper duel, guys. I made him despawn. It worked. We won. Everybody saw that, right? It was a clear win. Okay, I have an idea.
Come on, welcome to the stream. How's my day? It's been great so far. Thank you for asking. How about you? Yeah, that's gonna work. But we're g gonna need to exaggerate what I tried to do on the last bit a little bit. <laughs> we, we sneaked him. It worked. I uh, couldn't find the name there, uh, Jay. Could you repeat for me? So where are you? Squid is coming along really well. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Okay, we're going to need to do a little scaffolding maneuver from here. I don't have any blocks left. <laughs> no Gerald versus Brutus. That that could never end well. This needs to go here. Would be cool if I could make them hold tentacles through the nether portal. That is actually really, really cool. Would be a fascinating visual. Guys, I think we got it. I think we got the shape. Wandering Trader became a Looney Adventurer. Dude, that is awesome. Thank you for becoming a channel member. I would highly recommend going through the old community posts and looking for a video titled What is the Looney Adventure Really? It's all the way towards the beginning. That tells you what the secret is behind this world or underneath this world that I keep telling you about. You're gonna love that. Want to quickly mention that that is a secret for everyone. Members get a sneak peek, but you'll all learn about it because I don't want to make member-only content. Um, we need... <laughs> Wandering Trader, how are you so rich? No one trades with you. <laughs> I love that. That's great. Um... We need to uh, get more blackstone, guys, because we're out and we have two big tentacles to build. I actually trade with Wandering Trader a lot. But only only if he has, has Nautilus shells. But I, I have some friends who actually trade with Wandering Trader so often. They are basically their uh, gunpowder farm. Which is, to me se seems weird, but... I, it's been known to happen.
Wonder Trader has 300 million emeralds. That's a lot of emeralds. Blackstone Shulker, let's go. I love being able to just pick up Shulkers with stuff. Whoa, this place in the nightly shaders is actually kind of cool. I like it. Never paid much attention to it in these shaders. It's mostly the reflection on the outside or on the inside of the water circle. Like right here. Because the water is very transparent in these. Still not my favorite overworld shaders. Elytra switch and let's go. Carlo, dude, thank you very much for the compliment. That's crazy. Armor running low? Uh, it was just the Elytra, but we switched it out. Should be fine. Okay, there's one thing I want to consider before we start building this. Um, hello, Mr. Gast. Please get out. So what I'm about to do is make them a whole lot wider and thicker, these uh, grab arms, but I might not want to do that necessarily. I kind of like that they're um, they're thinner than the rest of them. I don't know if that is anatomically correct, but it looks cool. It looks it, it looks like it gives it more movement. Due to a lack of uh, size there. And I'm going to stick with that. It was look dried out. Wow. We can always make them a little bit wider later. But I'm gonna start off really uh, thin-ish. To keep that movement that I had right now. Because that movement looks, looks awesome. I love that. Quickly check my hot bar there to see if I had enough... Uh, Fire protection safety is in place. Uh, the golden carrots are there, so it should be fine. But point is, keep checking that, always. Technical knowledge. Moment when I was on half a heart. Um, back on day 45, which is a long, long, long time ago now. I got exploded by a creeper. Uh, my first horse, Danny, died in that incident. Um, we still miss him, clearly. But after that, it's only happened once when I rubber banded off a uh, desert temple on a landing that looked normal, <laughs> and then I just bounced all over the place. Uh, at that point, which happened quite recently, I had a totem, though. So I would have survived that. Only way I could die to mobs in a scenario like that, or die at all in a scenario like that, if is if the totem activates, but there's also mobs around. At that point, I'm in a bad spot.
Super Aaron, dude. See you around. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Have a great rest of your day. Gamer Abraham just joined back. Dude, welcome back. I'm gonna extend that a little bit. Uh, can we get to the side here? Only like this. Okay, that went wrong, but we can fix it like so. One of the stream classics, this song. Has been in my stream list all the way since the beginning. Still one of my favorites. Ow! Power back up. And now we get that one very important detail. Um, let me think about the orientation of this. I'm gonna need this here. Yeah, that's the right angle. Let's switch the shaders for a moment so we can see better what we're doing. And... Night Vision 2. Honey Bear, you're constantly worried about the castle being blown up by gas. Shouldn't happen. It's uh it's all blast resistant. I misplaced that twice. I might have made this too big, but we're going to find out in a moment. <laughs> it's too big, guys. It's too big. Bree, I know, right? Everywhere. Do I have walls in my inventory? I don't. That first design was way too big. Um, and then still we're gonna need to uh, move this entire thing up a little bit The design was right now, but it's not in the right place For a moment I lost my shovel. I was like what? Where, where, where they go? Lucas, how do I make the thumbnails? Um, I put them together in Photoshop, but the whole design is that the artwork is made by Queen Kitten. And she drew them on uh, a art program on a, on a tablet. I don't know exactly what she uses for that, but she has her own channel where she makes videos on it. If you're curious, go ahead and check that out because it's linked in the description. Oh, actually, Nightball just told you. Okay, that, that's going to go out of here, and that is going to be the last of it. It's almost exactly right. 
Nope, missed the landing. You seeing my progress coming along nicely? I agree, this is going quite well. We're getting there. <laughs> Part of TNT run, let's go. We, we're gonna do, uh, do a game before I end it. I'm on board. I love the way that kept its movement. That's good. I saw one part around the back where it's a little bit weird. Um, but I feel like what we need to do is just work our way down and place stairs or slabs everywhere. Uh, that will connect it up a little bit, but it will also spawn proof it. Note to myself and everybody in chat, Mining blackstone with a with a bow it doesn't work as well as you would hope. This song though. Listen to them go. Oh, that's a full block. It doesn't work. Netherite armor where? Uh, partly in my inventory, partially in my ender chest. But we currently have the fire protection set on, which is diamond, so I can see the difference. I think I placed it upside down or it was a was a slab. <laughs> Free I need efficiency on my bow. We'll speed the process up a little bit. I think that's it. I, I think that that's what we need to do. Low, low efficiency five on a bow. Everything looks so flat. With the normal shaders and night vision. It's crazy. Lucas intro music playing? Yes, sir. The playlist version of it. Love that song. Intro is legendary, both the song and the images. Ah, oh, that's awesome. Thank you very much. I look forward to editing the new one. When we get to 5k days. Because there's so much new content to put in there. Old Nether Hub wasn't really a thing a thousand game days ago. That's crazy. We had a little bit of a uh, incident happen here. Akshay, you would like to see today's progress? Uh, give me a minute. We'll uh, chase this dirt line. And then I'm going to give you guys the progress. And we're going to go on high pixel to play a couple rounds of TNT runs. So if you, uh, if you guys are interested in playing, start booting up your computer. Going on high pixel. Only works with Java Edition, unfortunately. But in a couple minutes, we're going to go there.
night vision did run out. But that's all right. Oh, we're falling. We are falling. Salvage it. <laughs> What's going on, Jay? Toxic place, dude. No worries. Have a great rest of your day. I hope the house is uh, is nice. Break that up. Almost there, guys. I'm surprised how much we got done today. I didn't think we we would get this far. Um, this needs the same shape as on the other side, but how are we going to manage it here? Because this is horizontal, and I would like it to be horizontal. Ah, we we um rotate it ninety degrees. Um. What I mean by that, we go up here, not going to be exactly the same, uh, same shape, but it doesn't matter. Alright, welcome back. What is the name? This one? Brutus is what he's called. Leandro, you're sick. Dude, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you feel better soon. Okay, that's it, guys. Only thing left is a little bit of the uh, stairs on this one. No ghasts. I'm trying to take a look at what we built. Get out of here. I thought that was going to hit him. Near miss. Didi, how do I... In, how do I plan to do the interior of the nether hub? Um, it's not an issue for right now because we're going to go to Looneyville first and then come back later to uh, do the interior for nether hub. I think this is the perfect vantage point. Not exactly. Probably here, top of this, oh, we're almost in the tree again. So, okay. This uh, tentacle needs a little bit of uh, thickening out because we didn't do the stairs there yet. Um, that's gonna happen a little bit later. Right now, we need to be up a couple of blocks for elevation, so we've got the right angle. <laughs> I can't quite find it. It's somewhere around here. So, back tentacle needs to be thickened out a little bit, but overall, it's, it's not here at all. Wait. 
We need to go this way. Somewhere. I'm gonna fly around this thing with replay mod. Because if we're flying around, it has the movement automatically. So flying around is always good. Maybe from a volcano? Actually, yesterday you watched the stream till midnight uh, or to two o'clock. Dude, that's crazy. I hope you enjoyed it. This tree is gonna have to go. Do we have the. Uh, the tools are here. Let's just get rid of that tree right now. Right now, I'm on high alert because there could be a piglin attacking me since I just opened. Um, a chest. Troop T, welcome back. How have you been? All right, this is the one tree that's gonna have to go. It's too tall for where it's located. Nothing personal, tree. I, I like I like your your look. Actually, it's it's uh, you're you're awesome, but you're in the wrong place right now. It's like the tallest tree in the forest too. But I have a plan. I have a plan. Wandering Trader says rip tree. Well, it's not completely gone. We're just uh, remodeling. That's what I say when I move a coral reef. Do I have another? Ow. I want to ask if I had another stack. Beautiful landing too. I do have more resources uh, over here. Three rockets. We're going to make it. Three rockets and a dream. Silky smooth Medra golf club coming in clutch. Always. That golf club is the clutch. So tree restoration. I'm gonna leave that one block in the middle out because then it just lights up nicely and that's gonna help with the look a lot please be the right height now oh tree I'm sorry tree I I, I, I try my best wait guys did I just destroy the wrong tree I did Don't tell anyone. Please, I beg you. Don't let it be known. Looney, destroy of wrong trees. It's not a good name. Rip to the another tree. No! No! I'm battling. No! No, I didn't mean to. Guys, don't don't go around selling cheap trees. I love trees. I, this normally never happens. Look how carefully I... I'm remodeling this tree. Love trees, always have, always will. Okay, I think we did it. We're also out of rockets right now. Luckily. No! 
No, not right now. Oh, I'm so glad he missed the volcano. Imagine just a fireball shooting up into that redstone system. I can see it happening. Guys, we did it though. The, the tree is uh, remodeled properly and we have the perfect angle. Look at Brutus over there. I'm just going to shuffle to this side of the volcano for a slightly better better look. This is such a weird camera to, to control your Minecraft character in, on the edge of a fiery volcano. I gotta say, I like the way that looks. I do like the way that looks. There's a lot going on there. Look at all that movement. Um, I, I see one... So two things I want to fix uh, about it. Uh, the end of this tentacle, right in the middle of the screen right now, I want to rotate that little fin thing on the end by 90 degrees so that we see it better. And then this one is still a really thin line because it needs to stare us everywhere. Um, so I'm going to do that probably at the beginning of the next stream or right before that. I'm currently going to take off because there's another gas and I just, he means business. Also made an accidental screenshot of nothing in particular. Always good. This is how I've tried to fight the Ender Dragon. Did not work at all. I had to switch to first person. Okay, let, let's uh, let's go over here. Guys, for those of you that already did, good on you. For those of you that still have to, go boot up your Hypixel right now because we're going to end the stream with a couple games of TNT Run. We're also almost on 2K likes. 1970, I see. I'm really curious if we can make that a solid... 2K. We're not going to go single player. Multiplayer. I pixel. Turn off shaders. Because that's too fancy. I've unclaimed leveling reward. Perfect. Slash stream. PvP run game is starting in 30 seconds. Click here to join. Create party. 24. Okay, Giant Eric did it really fast. What you guys gotta do right now is you type slash p join looney underscore mc. If you type that in chat, that's gonna happen. You guys gonna are gonna end up in a party and we're gonna play a game. Trihari, have I played... Bad Wars. I have not. You guys crushed the 2k as well. That's awesome. Thank you very much. There goes the replay mod file. It is saving. One by made it. Nice. Alright guys. Let's get busy. If you guys are not in the party just yet, we're gonna play one. <laughs> Creeper. Oh man. <laughs> also joined us. Let's get busy. If you're not in the party right now, after this, uh, after this run, I'm gonna disband the party, make another one, and you get another chance. My eyes feel quite tired, so I don't think I'm gonna do well here at all, but I'm gonna give it my best shot. I I'm breathing, I'm, I'm meditating, I'm getting ready. Eyes are closed, countdown is happening, eyes are gonna open up, reboot the system, and let's go. As always, very crowded early on. Somebody go again for the kill behind me. I'm just going to go down. Oh, that was accidental. Did not mean for that to happen. Now, uh, now we're in a pickle. In that case, there's nothing to it but to pump it up, Jay. Okay, there's 11 players left. We're doing well. I'm, I'm not slowing it down yet because we're uh, we're being hunted. I can hear it. Woo! Tricky situation. Did survive. Five players left. We're going to slow it down. Three players left. 
Actually won it! Nice! GG! Okay, I'm gonna disband it. Slash P disband. And we're gonna make a new party. New chances for everyone. Slash. Stream, getting ready. So guys, what you're gonna type, slash P join Looney underscore MC. That's what you wanna go for. This girl Jay has it in chat. Thank you, Jay. Here we go. Create party. 24. Go. <laughs> and I think the party's full. <laughs> Gonna give it a moment. Let's start it. I'm gonna go out here for those of you guys that want a uh, screeny. Alright. Rest. Ah, oh, I forgot to re rest the eyes and reboot the system. Instant panic at the very start. So usually. I try to find a uh, quiet place at the very beginning of a round and just try to make sure that nobody uh, goes over there and play all defensive. But I feel like if we do this on stream, I'm being chased around. So I have to keep moving a little bit. Speed is of the essence. Right about now, it should be getting more quiet up top here. So I'm going to slow it down. No, no, no. There's still people to chase me around. Uh oh, we dropped one down, which is bad because now we're in the same chaos that was just gone upstairs. I know there's no actual stairs, guys. It's, it's expression. It's a thing people say with, with the words. Okay, it's it's becoming a little bit calmer here. Not calm enough. That man means trouble. I can see it in his little pixelated eyes. Oh, that's what I mean. Oh, no, no. I tried to double jump there. I clicked the feather. It did not work. And now I'm in the worst of positions. No. Looney out. 21 players left. I was up here. I jumped here. And I wanted to do a double jump. Did not work out. After that, it was straight panic to the bottom. <laughs> Let, let's see how people are doing. Seth, see you around. Hope you enjoyed it. Oh, we got a fight going on here. Magastra, he lost. I couldn't recover there. Chess mood seems to have it all under control here. There's quite a lot of blocks ahead of him. That's looking good. Waiting storm is gonna collide. Oh, and Shuri jumps all the way down. He lost it. We got one by with the redstone face. Also, oh, he's doing the double double jumps. Is he recovering? He's going up way high. He's going up a whole layer. I didn't even know that was possible. Look at Wumba, but he dives down again with another double jump. Wait, that is a lot of double jumps. Wumba, man's got the go bonus points going. And then over here we have waiting storm. Who has a path ahead of him? Oh, but he also falls down. Just in time, Waiting Storm actually takes a win. One by second place. We're gonna do one more, guys. Last one. I'm gonna disband the party. Waiting Storm took the win here. It's a GG. Gonna take a sip of water. And then I'm gonna go with this slash stream so you can get your slash B join. Looney MC, you ready? Fissa, why were you in hard pixel? Uh, end of the stream. But in a moment, we're going back to the hardcore world. And you can see what we did. We made a lava squid today, and it's kind of crazy. 
Let's start this uh, one, guys. Chess mood loves the third place. It's a good place to hang out. Top three is uh, is respectable. Okay, this is the thing where I would normally hide out in the corner, but here it's... Oh! Accidental double jump. Here it's just not an option. Someone is gonna come for that skin, pink haired skin. That time the double jump worked, but I couldn't recover. Wumba was still up there with his redstone face. I remember that. Okay, it's time to slow it down. Um, I don't have much of a pathway here. Or do I? I do. Tricky jump around the corner. Now we're in an area with a lot of blocks. Actually, no. I can see them running out. No! I don't know how to do the double jump just yet. Looney out. Seven players remaining. We're going to see who has it. Volanter Yochi is doing it here. We got... Mr. Crunz boy, casually hopping around. He has he has a little bit of a pathway, but does he turn left here? Or does he get himself into a pickle? He's in a pickle. He has a double jump. Oh, this man has some double jumping skills. Three people in the same place here. Chess mood goes off into the distance, actually falls down. Two players remaining. Mr. Crunz boy with another clutch double jump. And here, Rom06 is falling down. Rom, no, Rom is out in second place. G G G G <laughs> Looney Butcher my name. It's it's been known to happen. It's a thing. You guys, thank you very much for hopping on for these. Before we end the stream, I'm actually gonna go back onto the hardcore world. For those of you that weren't here a moment ago, and are curious what we did today. Today we built Brutus the lava squid. Brutus is uh living in this lake over here. I'm going to turn on the cinematic camera and fly around a little bit. There's a lot of movement in the design. I'm really happy with the way this turned out. It's uh, back tentacle needs to be a little thicker. And that's most of it for now. Uh, we might alter more later. But for now, we just got to build the build around him. I did not expect that we were going to get this far with the uh, Brutus construction today. So that's actually uh, that's a clear win. This is, was a lot more progress than I was hoping for. But... It is all the progress that we have for today. And guys, I'm gonna be out for the weekend. So uh, tomorrow, one of my best friends is celebrating his birthday. I'm going over there to celebrate it with him. Really looking forward to that. After that, I'm gonna go editing on Sunday and Monday. And then on Tuesday is the next stream. So I hope to see all of you guys there for today. I wanna thank you very much for hanging out. I wanna wish you a great weekend. And I'm really looking forward to mine. So I'll see you on the other side. Probably with a story or two. Have a good weekend, everyone. See you soon. And until we meet again, Uni and Brutus out.